Hey y'all, it's Amanda with Tat Mama and the Big Brigade. Welcome back to my channel. This is Mornings with Jesus, our daily devotional. And this one is for Monday, January 22nd. Starts with a Bible verse and goes as follows. See what great love the Father has lavished on us, that we should be called children of God. And that is what we are. The reason the world does not know us is that it did not know him. 1 John 3, 1. Now our inspirational story. This past weekend, our college friends Lance and Tina came to stay with us. They were taking a much needed sabbatical as lead pastors of their church. Our weekend together was full of laughter, mostly because Tina has the best laugh ever. Tina and I decided to pamper ourselves with a morning of sipping delicious coffee and getting a pedicure. I told Tina that I wanted to treat her. Tina's manicurist finished her toes first sent and sent her to the front of the shop. When I joined her a few minutes later, <coughs> excuse me, uh, a few minutes later, I saw Tina putting her wallet away. I asked, did you just pay for your pedicure? I wanted to treat you. She started laughing and said, oh, well, then the receptionist told me that she had paid for my pedicure too. My shock gave Tina a great deal of joy. She had out treated and out loved me. I had to join her in laughing. Her generosity was overwhelming. All I could do was say, thank you. Jesus finds great joy in out treating and out loving me on our regular basis. He loves, he loves overwhelming me with his goodness and generosity. I don't deserve his mercy or his grace, but there he is, meeting me at every turn, lavishing his love on me. All I can do is say thank you. Susanna Foth Augmenton. Faith Step. Spend some time journaling about how Jesus has outtreated you this past week. Say a prayer of thanks for all the ways he has overwhelmed you with his love and grace. Well, I concur. I have experienced those over treatings too. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this one as much as I did. Please remember that I love you and so does Jesus and I will see you on the next one. Bye now.